What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. We are back playing some Pokemon Sword and Shield, hopping onto that ranked double ladder. And yeah, you guys heard that right. We are hopping onto that ranked double ladder because it is now February 1st, which means Series 8 is now live and we can use one restricted Pokemon per team. Today's video, we got ourselves a banger. We got ourselves a Rain Kai Ogre team. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys so much for the support that has been going out on the channel. I've been having a blast with all the new Series 8 teams. Speaking of Series 8 teams, if you guys want to leave me Series 8 teams, head to the link in the description below, jeans underscore YouTube. There's a link to my Instagram page down there. Go DM me over there. I'm still looking for a lot of the restricted Pokemon teams for Series 8, and potentially I will use them on the channel. I'm still looking for like a Dialga Palkia team, a Rayquaza, and like all the other ones. So if you guys are interested in making a team, or if you guys already have a team, DM me over there, send me the teams, or be like, yo, Jeans, what team do you want me to build? And I'll I'll let you know. I will let you know. But rocking out on this team, front spot, we got Kai Ogre, the heart and soul of this squad. We got Drizzle with him so we can set the rain. We got Mystic Water for a boost in water damage, and then we got stab moves like Water Spout, Origin Pulse, which is his signature move, Ice Beam for coverage, and Protect. Tornadus is right next to him. It's that flying type and it has Prankster and a Citrus Berry. They're going to pair really, really well up front with the Kyogre and the Tornadus because we got Hurricane. Hurricane hits 100% of the time in the rain. We got Rain Dance in case they want to change up the weather. We can go into a Prankster, which gives us first turn ability and get that Rain Dance and change the weather right back to what we wanted. We also got Tailwind, which will make Kyogre outspeed basically anything and just Water Spout and just do some massive damage. Then in the final move set, we got Taunt right there, which is going to be great up against support Pokemon. We got my face cam, we got the one and only Incineroar with Intimidate and those safety goggles. We can fake out, Flutter Blitz, Parting Shot, and Taunt. Nothing new for him. Partano over on that right middle slot, Leaf Blade, Sacred Sword, Smart Strike, and Guillotine. Oh my lord, I didn't even notice this team has this on it. That's a one-hit KO move. That is going to be crazy. Maybe we pull it off in today's video. If we do, that'd be crazy. This thing has the Beast Boost ability and that Assault Vest. Bottom left corner is a nice little support mom with Amoongus with the Regenerator and the Koba Berry. Clear Smog, Rage Powder, Spore, and Protect. Then in the final spot is a nice Light Screen Pokemon. And this Pokemon can hit really, really hard. It's Regilecki. Transistor, Light Clay, Light Screen, Reflect, Volt Switch, and Electro Web as his moveset. Guys, if you want to try out this team for yourself, Rental code is at the bottom screen. Go use it up. Go use it on the ranked ladder because Series 8 is now live. But without further ado, let's hop onto that ranked ladder and try to get some wins with this Kyogre team. First battle coming at you guys in Series 8. And are you kidding me? This guy's not using any Series 8 restricted mons. Hopefully, we can just dump on him and get this match out of the way. He has Dusclops, Excalibur, alongside with Clefable, Incineroar, uh, Tapu Fini, and Rillaboom. Rillaboom might come in here. He might come in here. Let's go. Let's check Summer here. I want to see the speed on this boy. Okay, so we're pretty good. Pretty good speeds on it, guys. We, we also have Tail and we have all that good stuff. He might he might bring him Rillaboom, which I really don't like. Hmm. I think we're going to go Tornadus into Kyogre. Try to get that rolling. I mean, if he goes into the Rillaboom, who can I have in the back? I could have a Moongus in the back. I kind of I kind of want uh, Incineroar. For that attack drop. And I kind of want... Either a Kartana or Reg or a Moongus. I don't want Reg like you. Do I have Kartana? Or do I bring a Moongus? Moongus could be pretty good. But I feel like Kartana is just going to be a lot better because he has a Steel type for the Clefable and he can do some work on that uh, Clefairy, or not Clefairy, on that Tapu Fini as well. We're going to get rocking out with that. But guys, like I said in the beginning of the video, if you guys want to drop me teams, you guys already know the link is in the description below to my Instagram page. But I want to go over some Pokemon teams that I already have so you guys don't waste your time building a team for me, expecting me to play it when I already have it. So I already have like a, L a Lugia team, a Yavelta team, I have a Groudon team, Sungoa, um, who else do I have? I, I have a Rayquaza team and Xerneas team on the way. They are on the way, so uh, they're kind of taken up. But if you guys do already say you guys already have an Xerneas team or Rayquaza team or a team that I already have, still send it to me. Maybe I'll like that team better. Maybe I'll use it. Just send me all teams that you guys have, Series 8, if you guys want to. But if you guys want to plan on building me a team, just ask me in the uh, DMs. Like, what legendaries would uh, would you like me to get? Because I still need, uh, who else do I need? I need uh, the Moon Legendary. I forget his name. The Moon Legendary, not Sengol, the other one. I need Necrozma. Uh, some of the Kyrams, the Reshirams, there's a ton more. Oh, Polkia Diablo. Polkia Diablo are top tier on my list. I really want them, and I do not have them. But first move coming out here, we have Kyogre and Tornado. The rain is going. I could set up a Tailwind. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I think I might just Water Spout. I do have Origin Pulse, which is awesome. That is an awesome move, but I'm going to go for a Water Spout. 
No doubt my mind is going to be for a water spout. After I set up this Tailwind, and then I'll probably drop Hurricanes off the top of Finny. Fable is going to protect. That's totally fine by me. That's a waste of a turn. And what are you going to do? What is, uh, what is What's Call going to do? Top of Finny. Maybe Calm Mind set up? Here comes my water spout. That one's going to get blocked. We're going to do a little bit of damage over onto the Finny slot, which is nice. But I can Hurricane it up next turn, and we have the speed. A little bit of damage. A lot of bit of damage onto a Finny. Go for a Calm Mind now. Yes. Okay, beautiful. So I'm just going to drop another Water Spout, and I'm going to Hurricane into that slot. Oh, dude, we love it. We loving it right now. Special Defense is boosting. It is boosting. Um, Yeah, I got to still drop a Hurricane. And then I'm just going to go for another Water Pulse. Or Water Spout. It might take it out. It might take out this Finny. I don't know if it will. It's going to be cutting it close. Special Defense boost. Mm, it might survive a little bit on the red. Because we did a little bit more than half. If we get a high roll here, we'll see. We will see. Kyogre is awesome. He's an awesome Pokemon. I'm loving it. I love, I love how he sets the rain. He can hit hard. He has Water Spout as well. Mm, wonderful. And he has Origin Pulse, which is his signature move. Which would definitely show off in a little bit. Oh, dude. Solid turn for us here. We're rolling here. We are rolling here. Fable's going to try to protect him. What is he trying to wait out? The Tailwind? What are you trying to wait out here? So now Fable... Can Fable follow me? Yeah, well, if we kill it, we can't, obviously. There's another water spell. I'm not Dynamax. I, like, I have water spell. Like, look at that. It is broken. <laughs> this is rank ladder, too. This is awesome. Get out of here, Fable. Get him out of here. Now, who are you going to go? I'm not Dynamaxing. There's no need for me. I have water spell. Yo, we're buzzing here. Yo, Series 8 is so much fun. I love the new series. I really do. Or when new Pokemon are allowed on the rank ladder. It just makes the game feel brand new. I'm going to go for an Intimidate. I'm going to dump on that thing. I outspeed it, and we're special attacking. <laughs> I'm just going to hurricane onto this left slot. We outspeed. This is going to be a double kill. It's going to be easy double kill. Unless he dynamax. Like, dude, I don't know what he's going to do. Oh, no, he's going to fake me out. He's going to fake me out. Kill on me. Okay, go ahead. Go after him. That's fine. I'm still going to be able to get off this hurricane. Can we KO with a hurricane? Maybe? No. Give me the ducks. Show me the ducks. Ah, he's burying up. He's burying up. It's fine. We still have speed next turn. I don't see Top of Finny taking me out. Unless it was Dynamax. He's going to drop a Moonblast. Dazzling Gleam. That's totally fine. It's easy eats, baby. Easy eats. Okay. Now the real call is... I'm still going to go for a Hurricane. I'm still going to go for a Water Spout as well. I feel like I have to. I feel like I have to. Even though our HP is down in half, I sh maybe should go for an Origin Pulse. But I think we're thriving here. I really do think we're thriving. We do not need Dynamax. You know, withdraw the Incineroar. That's totally fine. It's totally fine. I can hurricane on that thing next turn, too. Well, Finny's gonna protect you. Smart cookie. Playing a smart game. This is not protect. Okay, you love to see that. Can we take out the Finny here? I'm thinking we should be able to. Oh, we do get the ducks. Love to see it. That's huge. I need to get rid of the Finny right now. Water spout. Wait. Go take out the Finny. Ah! That hurts. That one hurts. Oh, ducks, hit yourself. Hit yourself, please. Mm. Mm. I don't like that one bit. Definitely gonna glide into me, right? Now the real call is... Who do I go after? What is the real call here? That one does peter out. Who do I take out? Definitely, I think I'm going to take off Finny here. I'm just going to protect. And then we'll Tailwind next turn. I think that's the play. Unless you read my Protect. We're protecting. I'm not letting you just Grass Glide into my Kyogre like that. Yeah. 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 Tornadus out speed, please. Love you. Love you, Tornadus. Hurricane's 100% in the rain. You say bye to Finny. Um, now I Tailwind and I drop an Ice Beam. Oh, you buttery biscuit. Rain stopping. I could set up a rain ants, but I'd rather set up a tailwind at this point. He's gonna fake me out though. He's gonna come back in here for another fake out and grace guide into me. So do I go for a double protect or do I swap? I think I might swap. He's gonna fake out my Kyogre, obviously. I think I might swap into do I swap into Cartana? Did I bring did I even bring Cartana? No, I, I'm gonna swap into my Incineroar. 
I'm going to swap into my Incineroar. Go here. I can Ice Beam. No, no, because then he dies. I'm going to swap into Incineroar. And we're going to swap into my boy Incineroar. Get buzzing with that. Because we already took out his top infinity, y'all. We're playing a good game here. We're looking for it. We're looking for it. Get after it. Incineroar comes out here. Double Intimidate on both of these guys, which is huge. The so minus one, minus one on both physical attackers. Big turns from jeans. We're going to be able to set up a nice little tailwind. Big guy's going to come out here. Oh, and you're faking out to him. How does he chill on me? We got a berry still. That's fine by me. Are you grassy guy over on to me, dude? See what you got. Yeah, yeah. Get out of my face. Get him out of here. All right, so cool. So now we're sitting like that. Um, I could get off the tailwind. Who am I worried about here? You might swap. Uh, I think I fake out the... Uh, I'm definitely going to set up a Tailwind. Hmm. Yeah, set up this Tailwind. I think I just... Nah, we're going to fake out something. We're going to fake out. Ruby might swap or protect, so I'm going to go after this Incineroar. We're going to do that. Yo, so he doesn't. I wonder what he's going for. Might be going for another Grace guy. We're going to be able to get off a Tailwind. It's a good first battle. This is a good first battle. We're getting after it. High horsepower coming in here. E. Yo, should have faked him out. But still, we eat that up. Eat that up all day. He's gonna be flinched. Um, okay, I'm just gonna go for a uh, Flare Blitz here. I could set up a Rain Dance if I really want to. But I do not want to right now, considering Incineroar's Fire. That would just not be a good call. Uh, I could swap him. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna try to land a Hurricane. I am just gonna try to land a Hurricane on that thing. Because again, I do not want to neglect some of that fire damage. We got speed now, and I still have a Dynamax. I still have Kai Ogre, and I still have Kartana. So I have options for my Dynamax as well. I have options. And we have Finny out the way, which is awesome. Which is dope. As long as I get rid of this, uh, Billaboom. Nice Hurricane Land. We get Ducks. We do not get Ducks, but Berry's popping. We trigger his Berry, which is nice. We get rid of that. And... Player Blitz should be able to pop through. Do we pick up the KO with this? Maybe, maybe not. We do. Get him out of here. Get him gone. Getting started off strong here. So this final mine is going to come out here. Totally fine by me. And he's going to go for a Darkest Slayer. Go over onto my Instant War, please. Can't my Instant War. Nope. That's one of us. I'm liking where we're sitting. I'm really liking where we're sitting. I, hopefully it's another physical attacker that he pulls out. Because if he does, I might just party shot onto it. Grass is gone. We have speed. Again, I still have Kai Ogre, but he's going to show his final mon. I s oh, no. This is his final mon? Who'd we KO? The Finny? The Fable. Yeah. Oh, my God. We dominate this battle. We dominate this battle. That's GG's. <laughs> that is GG's. That is how you get started here. That is how you get started in Series 8, baby. Yo, Kai Ogre team running things. Tornado's going to miss his hurricane, obviously. Stink. What about going to come through here? Do a little bit of damage. I'm surprised this guy didn't quit. I want the clean sweep. I want the sweep. I want the 4-0. Chill on me. Do not kill me. Do not kill me. Flare Blitz coming out here. Eat this up. He's minus one. Man, yo, I want... You know what? Now, now I got to bring out Coyote. Now you're making me do this. I didn't want to do this to you. I didn't want to do this to you. But I have no other choice. I have no other choice. You're going to kill my cloud guy. Now I have to bring out the god of the sea over here. On your fire type. Little punk wanna mess with me. Now the rain's going. Now you done messed up. Now you done messed up. Now you done messed up. And Origin Pulse hits both, which is nice. So I'm just gonna taunt him. Do not cancel this battle. Yeah, that's what I thought. I you kidding me? We missed my Origin Pulse? I'm taunting him because I want this Origin Pulse to hit. Not playing around. I'm gonna go for Dark Slayer. Eat this up. I swear, yo, he gets a crazy KO. It's like, I ogre. <laughs> I cry. That one peters out. We still outspeed this thing. I'm coming for you, man. I'm coming for you. I'm not playing around. I'm not playing around. There's no way he cancels the battle. Hey, get this guy out of here. Show off a little origin pulse action. Yo, that's dope. Get him out of here. Get him out of my face. Yo, that move is fire. That move is fire, especially because it's double hitting as well. And you get the rain boost on top of it. It's awesome. 
Solid first battle there, went pretty long, had a good one. I really did like how that turned out. We got the win and everything kind of went right. We showed off Kyogre and now we're hopping into our second battle. And this guy's got a Zacian team, which is cool, which is actually pretty cool. I still need a Zacian and Zamazeta team now that I think about it. There's just so many legendaries. I cannot wait to just show them all off on this channel. That is my plan is to use a team with one of each of the restricted mods. It's going to be awesome. But this guy's got Zacian alongside with Dragapult, Tapu Koko, Incineroar, Galarian Moltres, and Amoongus. Okay. Um, he probably thinks I'm leading the Kyogre. He has top of Coco. He might go into the Coco slot. That's kind of scary. Coco's probably not Sash. He probably might lead Incineroar as well. Kind of want to lead Incineroar. Just for that minus one on Dragapult. Or if he leads Zacian. Um, I'm going to lead Tornados. Try to set up a Tailwind. Try to get that speed buzzing around him. Uh, who else should I go? Who else should I go? I could set up screens. I actually might set up screens over Incineroar here. So let's withdraw Incineroar. Let's set up some screens. Uh, we want to go Kartana. And I think I just bring Kyogre as like a late back end Coco. That's my plan. That is my plan. He's definitely going to bring the Coco. He's definitely bringing the Coco. He sees Kyogre. He's like, yo, Coco's got to come in here. Because Coco outspeeds without a Tailwind. And it's uh, super fast. But yeah, you guys like the new hat? We got another hat. You guys know I, I like the Rock Beanies uh, during recordings. So I have this uh, maroon one now, which I actually really like, and I got a shirt to match with it. Got a black one, maroon one, and an olive green one now, but I'm really liking this one. But he's going to go, is that top of Coco? He's going to go Coco and Cinnamore. Kind of, kind of figured. So we are going to go in with these two guys right here. I can, I don't know if I really want to. I just, like, I, I'm probably going to set up a light screen. I get rolling with that. Electric Surge. Electric Surge, baby. My question is, who are you going to taunt? That's, what, that's my real question. Or who are you going to fake out? Who are you going to figure out? Because both these options are pretty bad for you, I guess. Because we're either getting off a Tailwind or a Light Shroom. I'm just going to Tailwind here. Nice, lovely Tailwind, and I am going to Light Shroom. I'd rather Light Shroom over a Reflect because Top of Coco is posing a threat right now. But I'd rather set up the screens, baby. You guys you guys know how I love the screens. Make a move. He's going to fake out onto... We're not. It's okay. So he's just going to take out my Tornado. That's totally fine. Light Shroom's going to pop. Maybe we can eat? With the Light Shroom? Maybe, probably not. Chances are no. Maybe he misses. Maybe he misses. Eat up. We eat all day. This thing's not doing any damage. He's just slowing us down. Okay, that's fine. So I'll totally be able to get off the Tailwind next turn. Speed's gonna drop, but Tailwind's gonna bring it right back up. Uh, do I slow down their speed? He kind of got some. I'm gonna go here. I might Volt Switch out. No, I do not really want to Volt Switch out. So I'm just gonna Electro Web. Slow them down as well. I was thinking of Volt switching out into my Kyogre, but it's just like, eh. It's, it's real risky. Electro Web's gonna pop. We're gonna slow them down just as well. A little bit of damage. And I guess we'll play a slow game here. I guess we'll play, I guess we'll play a slow match here. But yeah, coming from casual battles to rank, you can definitely tell the difference. You can definitely tell the difference considering the play style. Like, as you can tell, we're, we're both playing really slow, trying to just, just like slow the battle down, outweight the opponent, and go. But he's gonna party shot, which is smart. He's gonna party shot now. I really want to get off of what's going. I really want to get out my Kyogre. Hmm. Okay. Let's set up a reflect. It really depends who he goes into. If he goes into a physical attack, I'll set up the reflect. But right now he's kind of just wasting out my turns. He's gonna go in the Zassian. He's gonna go in the Zassian, so I have to set up a reflect. That is a lovely little. Player. He's gonna get us an automatic attack boost, which is awesome. That's nuts. Uh, do I taunt him so he can't set up? Potentially. Or do I just go into a hurricane? This is tough, man. A swap? I don't know what to do. I'm definitely gonna set up a reflect. I think we're gonna go for a hurricane. Try to get confusion on this thing. I'm gonna set up this reflect. Kinda help us out. Oh, this one's gonna be a tough battle. This one's totally gonna be a tough battle. I was thinking of taunting that thing. I thought he was gonna Dynamax. Let's see what he does. Let's see what he does. He's just gonna go straight for Behemoth Bash. So good thing we didn't taunt. Oh, he outspeeds us too. This is fast. I'm gonna go for my Regilecki. Show him my Regilecki, man. He's doing some damage. Hurricane comes out, we miss. God dang it, man. He's gonna be able to Volt Switch out here as well. Mm. I don't like where we're sitting. I really don't like it. Here goes our berry. Uh, he's gonna go back into Incineroar. I feel like he might. 
And in that case, we're gonna swap it to our Kyogre. Shit, I want another Tailwind. I do want another Tailwind. How many turns left? I think we only have one more turn left in Tailwind. He's gonna go back into Incineroar. So he is gonna get a Fake Out. He's gonna Fake Out onto my, uh, what's called slot, obviously. Yeah, he's definitely gonna Fake Out onto my, uh, what's called slot. My Tornadus, and he's gonna go into another Behemoth Bash. How many turns left in Tailwind? One, hopefully one. Two. I'm gonna swap into Kyogre at this point. I'll get off turn out, and I'm gonna slow all these guys down. That's the plan. That is the plan. We're not just gonna drop back, because he's gonna fake out the side. He's gonna go into another Behemoth Bash onto my Regilecki. So then we're gonna have that one turn left in uh, Tailwind Naked Dynamax and try to get rid of the Sassian. That's my thought process. That's my thought process here. I'm gonna go for the fake out. Oh no, you go for Regilecki? Please still get Zassian. Go after Regilecki. Go after Regilecki, please. Okay, cool. Alright, uh, you know, that works for me. That works for me. Alright, that's fine. Kinda give him a free turn there. That's better than him hitting my, uh, my what's it called. We go back into Tornado. I said we do. Only for the sheer fact is, uh, Hurricane's hitting 100% of the time. And we can get off another Tailwind once this one ends. But I am going to Dynamax here. I am going to die. Or do I not Dynamax? We should be about out speed. But I'm thinking I just going for this. Then going into a Hurricane. I'm kind of liking that. Does it Dynamax this turn? Then we'll Tailwind next turn. I am liking that a lot. So Hurricane comes out here. Give me the Ducks. Show me the Ducks. Give it to me. No ducks. Water spout comes out here. Doubling up. Incineroar's definitely dead. And Zassian's dead. Let's go, baby! Yo, Kyogre! He's a beast! He's a beast. He's a beast. Good thing we didn't Dynamax. Now I can Dynamax. Now I can Dynamax. I get off another Tailwind. We still have Kartana in the back. Oh my lord. Big plays by Jeans. Big plays by Jeans. Dude, Kyogre's so strong. He's so strong, man. I love it. I love it. I'm gonna go on top of Coco. I'm gonna be able to tailwind. I should be able to outspeed it after a tailwind. If not, I think we're eating up. I'm gonna Dynamax here. I'm definitely Dynamaxing our Kyogre. I'm definitely Dynamaxing our Kyogre. Tailwind, we should be able to outspeed Coco, right? I think so. Goes for an Electro Web, whatever he wants to go for. I'm definitely Dynamaxing. Definitely hit this Geyser. Getting after you. And I'm definitely tailwind. Definitely getting after it. Come on, baby. Let's go. And I still have Kartana in the back, which I love. With this whole vest. He's going to Dynamax first. Because right now he outspeeds. Until my Prankster Tailwind comes out here. Then we're fine. He's going to go Coco or Pole? He's going to go Pole. Which, again, I'm fine with. I'm fine with. Say we take out Coco this turn. We have Coverage Ice. We have Max Hailstorm. We have Max Hailstorm. Love to see. Get it out there, Kyogre. Get after it. That water spout was huge. I didn't know if we were going to take out Zassian, but that absolutely dumped on it, man. That was awesome. Let's get it. I thought he was going to Dynamax Zassian. I, th I think he didn't want to Dynamax too early because you guys seen some matches or you guys actually played some matches. We Dynamax early and then they end up waiting it out and just beating you out in the end. There goes my Tailwind. Lovely little Tailwind. Hopefully Coco's not sashed. I can see it not being sashed. Or did we already do damage to it? We should die here. We already did damage with Electro Light. Yo, Coco should be dead. Get out of my face. Yeah. Later, Coco. Get him out. Kyogre playing the game. Let's get it. Alright, so we outspeed the Drag Bolt, which is good to know. He's got, uh, not anymore. We're gonna go after Kyogre. Kyogre eats that up all day. Uh, do I go for a Geyser? I think we go for another Geyser, because I... He might be policy. Nope, he's orb. Okay. Well, what's doing more? That's the real question. What is gonna do more? I think, no, we gotta go for that. It's not paper. We're gonna go for that. We could set the rain up again. No, <laughs> we're just gonna uh, try to try to get off a uh, hurricane here. We're just gonna at least try to. Oh my god, we're playing so good. We're playing so good, man. We're gonna go for that worm one. Clearly we are special. We're gonna go after my Kyogre. Yo, Kyogre's bulky, man. He's eating up these shots, too. I think we're special attacking as well. Well, we made, like, I guess one bad play, you can say. Just swapping in that Kyogre, but it worked out for us. It really did. Hurricane lands. Did we get some ducks? We do get the ducks. Oh my lord. 
And then ha Hailstorm, wrap it up, baby. Let's go, Kyogre. Let's go, baby. King of the sea. King of ranked battles. Guy survives on one. He wanted to die by buffets. Unless he's goggled. Unless he's got he's not goggled. He's an orb. <laughs> there we go. GG. 2 and 0. 2 and 0 with this Kyogre team. I'm loving this team so far. I really am. We're gonna have to our third and final battle. Look for that perfect record to get Series 8 started. Look how dope it looks. Just going up against a Dialga. Oh my god, it's getting me hyped for Gen 4 Remix. I heard they're not confirmed yet, but I heard great sources leaked it. So it's like, yeah, they're definitely coming. Everyone's getting hyped for it. But third and final battle, looking for that perfect record for the Jeans Online Gamer Community, baby. Looking for it for you guys. I always love doing that for you guys. I know you guys enjoy that little saying. But this guy's got a Dialga team. He's got Dialga, Incineroar, Celestia, Landorus, uh, Tapu Koko, and Grimstarl. So physical attackers are going to be a rough patch for uh, me here. So Kart I might not even bring Kartana or Incineroar. Actually, I might just bring Incineroar. Go so Kyogre, Tornadus for the lead. I guess the fake out. Okay. Um, in that case, I might just protect. I guess a Coco as well. So I might go same lead, or do I go Incineroar? I might go Incineroar. I'd actually, no, I want to set up screens again. Screens definitely help us out. Just land up. Mmm. Mmm. I think I bring Kyogre. Uh, do I bring Incineroar final spot? Yeah, I'm thinking it. I'm thinking it. The Coco's scaring me, man. I'm gonna think with the Lando a little bit. Get after it. Let's roll. Let's roll, baby. We were able to take on a Coco last time. Maybe we can do it this time. I don't know. This one's looking tough. He has double intimidate. Luckily, Kyogre special attack. If it was physical, we would be uh, really in the dumps here. We would be really in the dumps. But, yo, I cannot wait to see Dialga. You better bring Dialga, man. You don't hop into Series 8 ladder first day and not bring Dialga to your team. Throw him out there. I'm sorry on Coco come out here. You better have Dialga, man. I haven't seen those awesome Pokemon in so long. Like, Diamond and Pearl is my favorite game. It's my favorite game. I remember playing it as a child. I put so many hours in that game. This is actually the only game I put in more hours, but that's considering I do YouTube stream and board and stuff. So it's like, obviously I'm going to put in more hours. But like, just sitting down, enjoying and playing-wise, Diamond and Pearl, I put in way, way too many hours. I had an action replay too. If you guys had action replays, let me know in the comment section down below. Those things were hype. Um, but first turn here, uh, do I set up Tailwind? Yeah. Set up a light screen as well. Light screen! Yeah! I love screens, man. That kind of helped us out in the last battle, too. That's why we were so bulky, too. I was saying that. I was like saying Kyogre's real bulky, but no, we had screens on. That I totally forgot about. I'll make a move. Is he gonna set up screens as well? He might fake out. He does have fake out out. From Strong. The Coco might just drop like a discharge or whatever, try to get it from my Tornadus. As long as I get off a tail. Ooh, he's gonna withdraw. He's gonna withdraw. He's gonna go into Lando. And that's totally fine, considering. Just gonna get off and intimidate. That doesn't do anything because we're special attacking, and we're not going for electric. Moves. And then I go for a hurricane if I want. This little tailwind popping here. You're gonna taunt me now. That's fine. My my tailwind came out first. Light screens out. I'm gonna reflect now because I do not want my boy doing massive damage, and I'd rather get off this reflect and get after it. Let's just go for a hurricane now. I'd rather go for a hurricane on you. And then set up this reflect, baby. Let's get after it. Come on, jeans, we buzzing. I love Landers' feet. How they have little clouds on him to keep him flying in the air. Like, he doesn't have wings. He's just floating. He's a god. <laughs> trying to think, what other restricted mods can he use? Like, I know there's a whole list. So I'm just forgetting a lot of them. I am just forgetting a lot of them. But there's a whole list. But it's so cool how they, how they did this. He's gonna start setting up screens as well. That's, that's pretty nice. And hopefully he just takes out my Regilecki after I get off this screen. But I can just get out Kyogre and Water Spout out speed. Hurricane misses. Dang it. Go ahead, Lando. I don't like this. Mm -mm. I don't like it, man! <laughs> I don't like this at all. Uh, I don't want to Volt Switch. I'd rather him just go down. I'd rather Magic like you just get hit hard, man. He's sword dancing again. Can you please land his Hurricane? Yeah. 
Yes, okay, give him the ducks. Some nice damage. Show him ducks. Critical hit and ducks? No ducks, he's rock sliding. Okay. Just not, okay, we can take him out here. We can take him. We need to land this hurricane. That's a problem. We need to actually. Watch this. Play to you right here. Play to you right here. Watch this, baby. We need to land this hurricane. And the only way to land a hurricane is by being in the rain. Jeans, you have outdone yourself. Outdone yourself, buddy. Really have. Really have. I'm impressed with myself. How far I've came in the Pokemon game. Now, I remember, like, first playing and just making so dumb plays and all that stuff. I still make dumb plays. You guys know that. You guys know that. You guys yell at me all the time. And I agree with you guys. <laughs> but, yeah, you guys you guys can definitely tell. From the people who watched me since the beginning I started Pokemon, uh, you guys know i gotten a lot better. And it's because of you guys. You guys give me tips in the comment section, and it really does help out. But it's like he's going to drop back. We're going to come out with our boy. Rain is going to get popped. And your Swords Dance boy over here is gone. Swords Dance dude is gone. Unless you Dynamax him. He's not going to Dynamax him. Hurricane's 100%. Get him out of my face. Swords Dance boy is gone. He could have Dynamaxed him. He should have Dynamaxed He should have. You guys know he should have Dynamax. Now, I go into a free water spout. That one peters out. I'm going to tailwind up again. And I'm going to go into a water spout. What are we going to do now? Water spout this more than orange and pulse at full HP. He's going to bring out Coco. Dialga. Yes! Yes! Bring him out! Yo, he looks sick. He looks so sick. Definitely set up a tailwind here. I'm definitely going into that water spout. I know it's not very effective over there. But dude, he looks so cool. Okay. He's gonna taunt me again, but Tailwind's gonna come out before him. If so, I should go down here. I should be able to outspeed. He's gonna Dynamax Yaga. Yes! Yes! I love it. I love it. I love the way Dialga looks. Let me know in the comment section down below. Were you guys Pokemon Pearl or Pokemon Diamond? Or who do you guys like more, Dialga or Palkia? I got personally got Pokemon Pearl. Because I have an older brother and he had first choice and he took diamond. But I can't I come to love Pearl. And I don't know if I like Palkia or Dialga more. They're real close. They're so close. They're one of the two coolest box art Pokemon or legendaries in my opinion. Fake tears gonna come out here. Don't don't do it on my Kyogre. Bye Kyogre. See you later, bud. Please get off this water spell, thank you very much. Good thing we didn't Dynamax. Come strong. Does not die, which I hate. Which I hate. Fake to me. Kyogre's dead. Okay, we're gonna have to deal with that. Yeah, this thing's rocking lightning. It's rocking lightning. Hey, dude, if we're gonna go after any Pokemon, it's gonna be the album. I don't mind it. I don't mind it one bit. Alright. So, see you later, electricity. You have speed. Do I have him? I think I have to Dynam. I have to Dynamax him. I have to! I have to. I like I have the Dynamax and Cinnamon. <laughs> this is our last call. Dang it, man! This one's not looking good for the boys. We do get off an Intimidate, but this thing's is he physical or special? He's probably special. Drop fake tears. Um, that's a Hurricane. They got Grimmy Pill. But guard though. But guard this turn. Oh, just flare. I think I set up this flare. Yeah, hey, we're gonna set up the heat. You know it's gonna do less damage. We gotta set up this heat. You're not fake tears me. You leave me alone. I probably should have guarded this turn. I should have guarded that turn. But he's gonna fake tears me. Just take me out. Hmm. No bueno. No bueno. <laughs> I probably should have guarded. He's gonna fake tear. He's gonna fake tear and dump on me. So if I would have guarded, I could have took out the Grimmsnarl and and, I, and then I'll get after it. But he's my he's my last option. He's my last option for Dynamax here. So I have to. Is he Dynamax? I didn't know he was gonna fake tier. I thought we were gonna be able to eat up a shot of whatever he had. I didn't know he's rocking lightning either. 
But yeah, definitely gotta learn to gotta learn the move sets of these guys down. That that's like the new thing. When new series comes in, you don't really know what's going on. But that's why why it's so fun in my opinion. Oh, Hurricane's gonna go first. Okay. So you're saying there's we don't KO. Never mind. Here goes our flare. Nope. Doing a little bit of damage, <laughs> and the rain's gonna neglect it. But we're changing for the drought. Like, this is my this is my last ditch effort. He's gonna go for a steel spike. Show me. He's gonna get a defensive boost. Take out you. Oh, he survives. We eat. We eat. You love it. We love it. We get defense boost. Retro Lucky's gonna be able to come out here and pick up the KO. Who are you gonna go after now? All right, he's just gonna spear break. Hard play. The Retro Lucky's gonna come out here. And I'm gonna be able to electro web. The light screen wears off though. Do I set up another light screen? Or do I? I think I just electro web take out the Grim Snarl. He might taunt me, which I don't like. He might taunt me, so I should just go into electro web. KO and uh, pick up a slowdown. And then just flare over into the outlet. This match isn't over yet. He does have a defense boost. I'm not liking it. This is his last iron max turn, so we'll have one up on him. So he might taunt me, he might taunt me. And then Retroleki should be thriving here fine. Grimstar is gonna set up a Lich. So I can set up screens next turn. But this uh, Electro Web should be able to KO it regardless, right? Yes. Beautiful, that's exactly what I wanted. Just enough damage to take out the Grimstar. He doesn't have a Reflect up, I don't think. I do not believe he does. Oh wait, was that his Light? No, that's his Light screen that ended. Not ours. We're like clean. We're chilling. Doing a little bit more damage on this thing. This thing's bulky right now. He's gonna flare as well and take out Regilecki. It comes down to a 2v1. 2v1, we have one turn left in Dynamax. I'm not gonna say it's over yet. We have stab fire. I don't, I don't think we take out Diago in one shot with a flare. He's gonna bring out Coco. And I think Coco's gotta go first. Right, Coco's gotta go first. He has that those fairy moves. I'm not liking that one bit. He might be Sash though. Mm, I do not like that. He could be Sash. I'm thinking he's Sash. I'm going to flare. Get this flare off here. I don't think we outspeed it even in the tailwind. Hopefully we do. Get it into normal. We still have... No, we have safety goggles. We're rocking goggles on. I was going to say, we still have a berry. Because most Incineroars rock out with a berry. We do have goggles here. Very good three matches here. Coco protects? No! Well, unless they're double protecting. No way Coco protected there. Smart, smart protect there. Okay, Flare Blitz will take that out. What are you gonna do? He's gonna go for a Thunder. That's easy. Okay, hey, Dialga's. Okay, our oh, Light Screen wears off Inner Tailwind. Hmm. So definitely got a Flare Blitz into the Coco slot. Take him out. Get him. Get him. Oh my lord, this one's gonna be close. Actually, I don't know. He might just gleam me. See what happens. He's gonna gleam. Eat up. Say, yo, that's Tasty Snacky out there. Deets. Flare Blitz comes out. We do outspeed the Alga. We do outspeed him. This should KO Coco. Coco's gone. We're, we've been eating up these moves that he's been sending our way. Thunder misses. Cool. You guys probably like, I'm lagging because I knew that miss. But no, you can tell by the way, like, uh, the timing goes. That if it misses or not. Now we can Flare Blitz. Hold up, yo. Hold up. Yeah. Come on with jeans. Yo, all we gotta do is eat up one shot. This is drought gone? No, drought is not gone. Actually, drought is gone, right? That's why he did it. Good parting. You could start parting on him. Hmm. We just gotta go for flare butts. Will two of them take out? I don't know. I hope so. I think one more might. We got the burn! Oh my lord, we just gotta eat up a shot. Eat up a shot! We got the burn. Thunder. We should be able to eat this up. It's not sad, but it's in the surge. Was that crit? It wasn't eat. Mm, that KO'd, man. Oh, I thought we were going to eat it. Yo, GG. 2-1. Dialga takes the victory in the end there.
amazing set of battles to start off series eight we dominated the first two battles with kai ogre we were able to dynamax him use water spell and show off him to his fullest potential and then that third and final battle was an awesome battle as well it was long drawn out hard fought we got to show off a dialga team going up against one as well but we ended up losing in the end but still solid two and one but guys that is gonna be it for today's video if you did enjoy the content don't forget to smash that like button for me and if you're new here click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live and if you guys have a pokey or dialga team definitely send it over to me i would love to get my hands on them and make a video out of a pokey and dialga team because those are two of my favorite legendaries and i would love to show them off on the channel but seriously you guys rock out make sure you spread some positivity today and i'll catch you all in the next one peace out everybody